Hi, good evening. My name is Jerolly Burnett, and we're here at the Franken Institute in Philadelphia. Next to me, we have Frank Lisi, the director of the Red Corvette. And Frank, how are you feeling today? Ah, full energy, full energy. You look wonderful. Thank you. Finally, the day has come to showcase your greatest uh, film. How do you feel? I'm very excited. We shot it here in Philadelphia. I have all my friends, the cast, the crew. We're selling out the IMAX theater. It's going to be an exciting night. Great. And can you please ex uh, explain more about the movie? Uh, how did you come up with the script, the, the whole entire plot? Sure. The Red Corvette was based on a true event, the beginning of the film, and then I ran with it and I added my own insanity. Um, we shot it and we started casting in 2009. We shot once a month for about tw 12 months and uh, from script to screen took two years and now we're hitting all festivals throughout the uh, country and we're working on a distribution deal as we speak. That's great and how was casting for this film? Was it easy, hard? Well it was, uh, I got most of the principles within the first couple of uh, casting calls but uh, the lead character Valerie she was the last one cast. I, I'm glad I waited, and she did a wonderful job. That's the best. That's the best part of it, yes, you know. Yes, I'm very happy. And anything else? Uh, what should we expect from the movie? Any uh, fun facts that we should know behind the scenes of the movie? Well, um, Vinny Vell is a bad guy. He's always a bad guy. Okay, but I'm his boss, so I guess I'm worse than he is. But you're gonna like it. It has a little bit for everybody. It's got some sex, drugs, and rock and roll, and. Uh, that's why everybody's here of all ages. They love that. Well, great, Frank. I'm so glad to be here, and I'm glad that you're here, too. And I can't wait to see the film. And thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.